Good evening. How is it going? Welcome back to another edition of What We Get Wednesday. I am Average Will. It is June fifteenth. God, we're already done. We're already halfway done with the dang month. Years flying by. The month is flying by. Time needs to slow down. We've got a bunch of people already talking in chat. I love to see it. One was here over an hour ago. Mike Pratt. That was great. I've uh, got a couple things tonight. We've got our weekly giveaway. We also have the 250 sub giveaway. Those are going to be done at the end of the night. I got two separate wills for those. Uh, we're opening in different stuff. I've got the LCS pickups. I've got two uh, two of the Janky <laughs> Series 2 openings. I've got some auction wins from the Mikes, Mike the Collector and Mike Rogers which are some awesome little books. And uh, yeah, I mean, that's pretty much it. I just got done filming uh, a couple videos uh, for the next two weeks. Uh, I filmed tomorrow's video and then I filmed next Thursday's video. Uh, I thought they were pretty good. <laughs> I liked, I like the boxes next, next Thursday is going to be a nice little box. Uh, it was the pop King Paul mystery box uh, for, for comic book mystery box, the second one that he ran. So, We'll also be announcing what the giveaway for next week is and all that fun stuff. I got some doggos coming in here, a whiny boy, my big old 115-pound Great Pyrenees lab mix. My daughter must have kicked him out of the bedroom. So uh, before we get into everything, let's get into the rundown. So pretty much that, I, I think I just handled the rundown, right? I, I, we've got the two giveaways. We've got the weekly giveaway where we are giving away – a mailer of books uh it's not already sealed i can show them off i'll show them off before i do the giveaway and then i have a beautiful flat rate mailer that has some goodies for the 250 sub giveaway uh again i want to say thank you to everyone for all your support i'll get to chat in a second um i love seeing all the conversation already it makes my heart swell and it makes my heart warm seeing it um I want to say thank you guys. Uh, thank you. We're at 289 subs now. Uh, we're on our way to 300. Then when we get to 300, we're onward to 400. And hopefully this little engine that could will just keep chugga, 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 choo, choo. <laughs> try to keep, try to keep the, the train on the tracks and keep this thing moving forward. Having a good time doing this stuff, man. The box battles have been fun against my wife. She's kicking my butt, guys. Uh <laughs> Just wait, just wait until you see next week. Just wait until you see next week. Um, maybe I do I get my redemption? I'm hoping. I'm hoping I can finally get a win. You guys will see because uh, we already recorded that one. Um, so I do want to say again, thank you guys so much for the support. Thank you guys for watching my videos during the week. Thank you guys for liking them and the comments. I love I love the interaction in the comments. I love being able to sit here and talk to you guys and interact uh, versus here and uh, you know, on Instagram, uh, again, I, you know, I, I, I love, I mean, I, I love the community. Uh, you know, I love the people that I interact with in the community and, and the, the friendships that I'm able to, to grow with everyone. So, uh, I, I really do agree. You know, I, <laughs> I agree. I really do enjoy, uh, joy, joy, the situation that I'm putting myself in here, you know, just being, having a good time and everything. So let's get into the chat here real quick. Uh, I love it. Uh, we've got, Mike Pratt was here two hours early. Now, if that is not if that is not tailgate, and I don't know what is, he was here uh, one hour fifty six minutes, one hour seventeen minutes. He's got the countdown going. Forty seven minutes, 30, 31 minutes. Newbie comics, man. Thank you for coming by, saying what's up, everyone. Then we've got Joe M. Dude, Joe M. I saw your your Stevie B. Opening. Uh, you got juiced up, man. I have mine. I'm probably not going to film that for a week or two just because I'm trying to keep it at two weeks clicks because uh, I don't want to get too far ahead of myself just in case there's things I want to announce. Like if something happens where we jump up and we we blow up from 289 to almost 500, I want to be able to inter, you know inter, interject into the videos about the potential of the giveaways. Um, so Joe M, awesome, man. And you, you told me which one you hit. That is great. I get to talk to him at 9.30 start time. He's on the East Coast like me. Nice. Dang. Yeah, Mike. Because Mike is up in. And how about this? 
Mike, Mike is camping up in the Canadian wilderness, and he is joining us tonight, man. Thank you so much, Mike. You are a great friend. You are a great buddy. Uh, I can't wait to see what you get. I don't know. I've seen some of the other pools. I'm excited to see what everyone's getting in there, in their mystery boxes that I sent out. Um, I, I mean, I love it. Uh, so we got – see who else we got. K. Titus from – the man from Japan. It is – about 10.30 a.m. over there for you. Good morning, sir. I hope you had a good breakfast. You're enjoying your day. Uh, and, man, um, so let's see here. We got Mike, more Mike Pratt. Mike Pratt, K. Titus, man. I love it. Uh, Todd, how you doing, Todd? Uh, I think this is the first time I've seen you around, man. That's awesome. I love I love seeing new faces because, again, I'm, I'm a little itty-bitty baby. We're a little baby, baby channel here. We're a little baby channel here. We're a little itty bitty channel that's trying to grow. That's trying to be a big, you know, big big boy channel, right? We're trying to be. Uh, so I love seeing new names, man. I like I like the 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 consistent, you know, guys that you, the 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 folks that are constantly commenting on every video. I love it. K Titus is on every single video, man. I love it. I appreciate, man. You coming in? You watching my videos? You comment, Geeky Mama Bear, Mrs. Juliana. How are you doing? Uh, she is doing some great things. Her and Mama Jay, if you guys are not watching their weekly live stream, you should be watching. I kind of lurked last night because I had a long day working and uh, I was beat, man. So I was laying in bed kind of listening to their their live stream a little bit and everything. Um, and Bearded Barbarian, how are you doing, man? Enjoy your videos too, man. I, I love, I love, I love how you use the axe. The axe is awesome. So just trying to scroll through here. Got a lot. We got Flash Ray. Flash Ray, who he was telling me last week that he works midnight, so it's a little tough. It's good to see you here, man. Thank you for coming by. Uh, I love it. Thank you guys so much. Um, let's see if we got any questions here. I was kind of just reading names on who was commenting, so I'm still, I'm still. This might be the 11th episode, but I'm still new to having a full chat and everything. Uh, let's see. No, I appreciate it, Geeky Mama Bear. Again. Uh, I enjoy your guys. I enjoy the channels. I enjoy watching. I mean, I sub. Every, I sub a lot of people up, and I like. I like seeing the different thing. Oh, it's eleven thirty a.m. Okay, so you're thirteen hours ahead, not twelve. All right. Um. So, uh, I mean, again, I, I I enjoy everything. You know, I enjoy the like how the the night that Dead Zone and you guys were all opening. Uh, it was Dead Zone Quick Draw. Uh. Mama J Inspector and and you Geeky Mama Bear, you guys were opening up boxes and I was loving it. I was like, oh, that's so awesome. So quick and speaking of quick draw, there he is. How you doing, quick draw? Uh, you you and the 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 Instagram tag of the days. I love. Uh, again, if you guys are not following quick draw, which I think you guys all are, we, you know, we we all seem to follow each other in that manner. But um, I, I love seeing all the different stuff you put up quick draw because the way you set it up man it's 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 awesome I, I love seeing that all man so oh hey no I mean that's fine I appreciate it and then did you uh Geeky Mama Bear did you get those the the one comics from um Shorty the, the Deadpool comics. So, man, I've got... Jesus, these guys are over $100. I'm sorry. Like always, like normal fashion, because the night I choose to do my live stream, so I'm not interrupting any other live streams because I like to watch my live streams myself. I chose 1030 for a reason. And then, why do I have this on top chat? Every time, every dang time. So let's go live chat. There we go. There we go. Sweet, sweet. That's cool. That's cool, man. I, I mean, again, like Kiki Mommy, I liked your, I liked your photo the other day when you did with uh, Deadpool Duck. It was awesome. So I've, I've got to actually set stuff up. I've got, I've got the different pops and everything. I want to kind of set up some of my stuff. Um, I've got a Vader a Vader raw comic that I want to put with, I'm, I'm on the wrong side with the slab and the Vader. I just got to actually take the time to actually take the photos. Cause I think they look cool, man. I think they look awesome. So 
Um, so where was at? Oh, I was rambling on about streams, other streams. I've got, of course, I've got a uh, auction here on my phone just because why the hell not, right? Because again, I, I can't stay out of the auctions. I love them. So, but uh, um, I guess I, I guess let's get into opening things because again, I want to kind of get through here. I don't want to have this going too too late because I got to be up at five o'clock in the morning to get ready for work and get out the door. I know some of my East Coast uh, folks have to be up early too. So, oh, you're getting. Uh, you're a Gators fan? Oh, no, newbie. Oh, no. Oh, I don't know, man. Uh, oh, I mean, yeah, flash rate. I, I love it. I, I'm so happy I was able to get that and win that from... Uh... <laughs> oh, man. It's funny because my, my daughter... My daughter was, it was between uh, Florida State and Florida for college. So I'll just say she made the right choice. So we're going to go with the LCS pickups. This is the stuff I got. I'm bummed, super bummed, because apparently they messed up my my LCS's order. Uh, it was broken up. Um, he was pissed. When I showed up Tuesday night, he was on the phone with uh, his distributor and was, uh, <laughs> was, was bitching a fit because... They only got, he was supposed to have like a hundred of the um, Venom 26s. He got 15. Thankfully, my box was one of them that he he put them in. Um, but no Undone by Blood, which sucks because I love that. I love that story. So no Undone by Blood this week for me. Um, I can read it digitally, but he said it, it, it's coming in. They'll have it in Friday or Saturday, so I'll have it in my box next week. So I'll just read it whenever I get it next week. But that being said, um, how is she getting ready for college? She's doing all right. Well, the thing, and that's the thing. Like right now, we have we have to make a decision uh, before I get into the LCS books. We have to make a decision by I think Friday. Um, I have to pay for housing. We have to pay for every I mean, her scholarship. Her scholarship pays for housing because it's not like to reserve her spot um, because they are doing all remote classes at the universe university she's going to. Um, she's got to. Uh, she's got it. They're doing all remote classes, but in order to um, to have a spot, like say after this stuff starts clearing up, hopefully, hopefully we start clearing up when we get near the new year. Not likely, but hopefully. Uh, and they can actually go to, hey, how you doing, Amanda? Thank you for coming by. Um, they can actually start going into class and actually having full classes again. Uh, she'll have to be on campus. So we have to reserve her spot. Um, we have to not reserve her spot, reserve her room. So we have to still pay it. Uh, they have a choice. They can either live on campus and do stuff digitally or re digitally remotely, or she can she can stay at home. And, and do the stuff and kind of get used to the classes and everything and and kind of get the feel of it. She loves her schedule. It's a lot different than a high school schedule. Uh, and that's one thing she, like, again, she's high up. Um, she's, uh, sorry, don't mind me. I, UFC event is on. They're fighting on Fight Island. They have an event on. So I've got that over here on, on the other screen. So if, anytime I look over here, I'm just trying to see what's going. I mean, just checking out the fights because I'm catching that out of the corner of my eye. Um, <laughs> squirrel, I'm so, I'm so I'm so squirrely, man. I'm so sorry, guys. Uh, but yeah, so the, she can live on campus and do it remotely, or she can stay home and do it remotely. Uh, she's going to make that decision by Friday, so I believe it's Friday. And then move in, I think, is in two weeks. So if she's going to move in on campus, so I know that was a very long winded answer, but yeah, that's what it is. That's me. <laughs> So, uh, nice to see you, Amanda. Amanda's dog tried to uh, open her mystery box, try to chew the side of it. Man, she she showed me a, she showed me a photo. And Mike, to circle back to your comment, man. Um, yeah, I don't I don't like. I mean, I'll read the digitals to catch up, but like one of the things I bought is um, 
uh, I is getting the trade paperbacks just so I can get caught up like with uh, Gideon Falls, which is dropping it just dropped a new issue. I think like issue 27, 26, something like that. Uh, I'm, I'm getting the trade paperbacks instead of trying to find the individual copies and same with like nail biter nail biter. I like nail biter returns. So I'm buying the trade paperbacks instead of reading it digitally because same with me. I mean, I have it on the tablet and I can read it on my tablet and everything, but it's not the same as actually having the book. So let's, let's get this bad boy moving. And first is first is the free comic book day book. It is X-Men number one. And this is, I think they said this is the lead-in to uh, X-Sword. I think is that, or Sword of X or something like that. So. Oh, my God. You can't even see his screen. Sorry. There's somebody doing a uh, claim round, and it's like, uh, can't even read it. So there's that. And then, again, talk, speaking of Gideon Falls, this is the first volume of um, Gideon Falls. I've heard so many good things about it. Um, so I wanted to grab it and check it out. And then if I like it, I'm going to definitely, which I think I will, I'm going to end up buying up the other trade paperbacks until I get caught up to where I can just buy the last few issues that have been released. So this is a, this is a uh, series that's come out, I think, I think – uh, Number three drops next week. It's it's a little bit different than the stuff I read. It's a little cartoonish. It's a little more like a uh, <laughs> it's a guilty pleasure, I guess you could say. Uh, it is <laughs> Wicked Things. Uh, I picked up one and two. Uh, what it is about, um, and I'm not ashamed. I'm not ashamed to enjoy this story. But it's about this girl here. Uh, this is the girl's best friend, but this girl here, she is a junior detective, or uh, I think they have like a junior detective society where they're really smart, young detectives, and she gets, hey, what is up, what the deuce, thank you for coming by, man, uh, she gets framed for murder, so uh, <laughs> it's, uh, yeah, it's not what I usually read, but hey, it does, that is exactly what I thought too, Amanda, when I first saw this cover, I was like, Kim Possible? Well, why the hell not? I liked it. So it's good. It's a, it's my guilty pleasure. Um, <laughs> it's on my pool list now. So uh, next is, I didn't pick it up when it first came out, but I did read it. It was one of the ones I read digitally. Uh, Spider-Man, or Spider-Woman 1. And then, of course, I picked up Spider-Woman 2. Uh, it's not a bad story. I, I mean, I don't know. I, I guess... I guess it's it's all right. It's not bad. It's interesting to see how like she she got her powers. So yeah, here's the first two. First two. So um, I like it. I'm gonna keep reading it for a little bit and see if it if it can. Uh... Oh yeah, geeky mama bear, and that's and that's like with me is I've got to pick and choose like what I want to get. Um, you know, it's like, there's a couple things that I thought like, uh, with the amazing Spider-Man only reason I, and, and I, and that segues, Hey, how you doing? 83 pop talk. I don't know if that's you Wayne or not, or, um, what is it? Oh, dude. I appreciate it. Deuce, man. Just let me know. No, it's Bev. All right, Bev. How you doing, Bev? Thank you guys for stopping by. I mean, I, I appreciate it, man. Um, and I'm sorry. I got thrown off because what the deuce. Dude, that's awesome. I, I, I appreciate it, man. I, I I appreciate it. So here we go. This is issue 44 of uh, The Amazing Spider-Man. I, I have to get the, the zombie variant. And then here's the original cover. Oh, I know. I watch their stuff all the time. I mean, I, I love their videos. Um, I like, I like how, and then, uh, Tristan, whenever they were doing the videos with Tristan, I loved it. My son, me and my son, John, we watched them and he would get so excited, uh, seeing, seeing, Tr that's his name, right? Tristan. I believe that's what his name was. I don't want to, to, to say his name wrong, but, um, 
yeah, my, my son my son loves watching videos with me. Like he'll have me put it up on the big screen in the, the living room because he likes to see what pops everyone gets because then he's like, Oh, that's the that's the ultra rare chase version, and it's a common. I'm like, Yeah, yeah, sure, sure, buddy. But uh I don't know. This seems like this is a little bit um this is a little bit drawn out. I don't know. I'm I'm trying to to get into it. I've and the only reason I'm starting to pick it up is because um I got a bunch of them from one of uh, from a lot I bought. I think it was off of God. Who, I don't remember who it was, but they had like nine or ten of the Amazing Spider-Man books in it in like a thirty book lot. So I was like, well, I guess I'll start picking them up. Um, but yeah, he gets so excited. Like he'll go like when I get a new pop, he wants to see the back. He wants to see the back to see all the different pops that are on there. So he'll take it and he'll look and be like, ooh. And again, not knowing these, he's five. So he'll be he'll point out like this one's this one's like the mega mega grail. I'm like, yeah, buddy. <laughs> so he gets he is five years old. He is he is a a big old five. He'll be six next month. Um, and I'm actually gonna do I want to do a special. I don't know if I'm gonna do like a special video with him or um he is he is so he loves this stuff, man. He he's a he's got OCD. Um, he, he has been diagnosed with OCD, um, and it's, he's got some other stuff, but, uh, he is very like obsessive. Like he will like, so he, he wants to, Hey, how you doing McDork pops? Thank you. And I just saw you sub. Thank you for subbing me up, man. Thank you. Thank you so much. Greatly appreciated, man. Um, but, uh, yeah, he, he loves collecting them and that's like, I'll give them to him out of box. Uh, and he'll he'll we'll set them up on his dresser, and he goes in there and he looks at them, and then he'll he'll play with them for a little bit, and he's like, ah, I got to put this back on my dresser. This is my collectible. Uh, so he he loves seeing them, and he'll come in, and he knows, which I talked about it before. He'll come in, and if I've put new pops in here, like Lady Deadpool, when he saw Lady Deadpool, he got so freaking excited. Uh, Lady Deadpool is his new pop in my collection, so. Uh, he, he loves, he loves, um, he likes Disney. Uh, he likes, he likes the poke. He, lo he loves Pokemon. He is huge into Pokemon. He likes Disney. So. Did I miss something from? Oh man. So <laughs> he's doing one for you too. Geeky mama bear. Nice. Uh, and that, and that, and again, you know, that's what I love about this community. It, it's great. I, I know I've sent out some stuff to to some people that I I enjoy. The, again, I enjoy their channels. I enjoy the the people that they are. So, you know, if if it's something that I, I think they like, um, I've sent it out. I'll send something out to them. And that's why I want to do like these giveaways and and do stuff. So I might even change change it up a little bit um, and kind of like. I mean, I wish they had polls on here, and they don't have polls anymore. How you doing, Superior Superior Hero Reviews? Again, every time, every time I see your name, I want to say Superhero. Um, but, yeah, I got sidetracked. It's, it's not hard. It's not hard to do. I got, like, four four different things going on here. So, um, Oregon, how you doing, man? Good to see you around. Uh, so, yeah, back to, back to what we got with the LCS, because, again, I'm squirrely, and I'm all over the place. So we've got Strange Adventures number three. I, I'm digging this. I know a lot of people think it's a little little drawn out and convoluted. Um, I'm digging it. Um, it is only a 12-part miniseries, so it, it's it's interesting how they're they're go, jumping back and forth between his time on the other planet to his time at home on the home planet. It's really cool. His wife is the focus is a little bit more focused in this book. Uh, I like it. I think it's pretty cool. And then this next one is one of I, I think it's you know it, it's it's I, I love this little thing. It is a mini series, but it is Year Zero number three of five from what is it? Yeah, AWA. They are putting out some great books. So this was a good read. I like zombies, and it's it's a five part series. So, oh man, nice! All the different, yeah, all the different Deadpool's, and then 
my favorite character, or one of my favorite characters, Venom, and this is the new the new start of a new arc. This is Venom 26. This is Cyrus. I have like three different copies of this book. I know I have one, I think, in Shorty's box that I have sitting over there. And I have one that's coming in that is the Virgin Variant. Can't wait to get that one because I'm probably going to send that to get slabbed. Uh, because, again, I think this is awesome. This is not a symbiote. This is someone who's wearing armor. And, uh, again, I would say if you're not reading Venom, it's 26 issues. Uh, it's such a good book. Danny Cates. I'll tell you right now. Danny Danny, God dang it, Donny Cates. I keep saying Danny because I have somebody that I work with that his name is is Danny, um, and he looks like Donny Cates. But uh, Donny Cates, I love I love this series. Uh, I'm, I'm loving everything that he's doing. He's got he's doing this and Thor, and I love both of them. So if you're not reading this this version of Thor, of uh, Venom, I recommend it. <laughs> so because um, it's a good read. So those are what I got. Those are the books I picked up this week. Uh, I've got Undone by Blood that is, it should be sitting in my box next week, so I'll get to read that. Oh, 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 we almost forgot. Something that also came out with Free Comic Book Day is the Pop Comic Tea Combo. And Oh, uh, that's my box number if you guys wanted to know. 540. So... And I love it because I I think it was uh, Chubby Pop Chaser. He got his box and it was it was beat up and the comic was ruined and nothing would piss me off more than that because it's like you know you're getting it for all three. So oh ice okay so this is the black tea. This is one that my wife was kind of because. The tea's not for me because it doesn't. I think the biggest size is two um, X, so I just got I got my wife's size. So it's it's this one. It's the black one. That's the shirt. So I'll let her open it in the morning. And then you got this guy that's going to be going in the collection. I got to get used to holding stuff up in this damn camera. So there we go. I like this pop man. I like Loki. He's one of the other. Oh, he's a little. <laughs> he's a little tilted, and he is, he's holding, I didn't realize that, oh, I'm going to have to take him out and fix him, because he's popped out of his plastic, but if you, I'm new here, guys, if you guys can see, I don't think you guys can, maybe, maybe you can, you see right there, he's holding the hammer, if you guys are reading the current story, you know what happened, so, that is awesome, uh, so here is the comic. I'm going to gently take this out. And then here's the comic. So I'll put a... I'll put a board. Eh, it's got a board behind it, thankfully. But I will... Uh, I think I saw somebody say about Slab in this. Uh, I, I can't remember what it was. Somebody was talking about they were going to send it to Slab, I guess. Um... So that's what that is. I know that these things are freaking hot uh, because not everyone was getting them. I know that my LCS, he got 20 of them and they were all gone. Oh, you guys did order the carnage? Yeah, I ended up pre-ordering it to where I got um, through my LCS to where I got the carnage pop and the uh, the comic. Because what they were doing to people, uh, the stores, because my LCS confirmed this as well, is... They were, they were telling them that they had to order six of the pops to get one of the comics. And my LCS, he's like, well, I'm not, I have some pops. He's like, but we carry signed pops. And we we carry, like, you know, he's like, because he does carry the, the signed pops. And he has some pops, but he's like, I'm not going to order, you know, <laughs> a, a, you know, order boxes and boxes full of Carnage pops just to get a handful of comics. So, um I did end up pre-ordering it through, was it Entertainment? I think it was Entertainment Earth that had it. Um, I think that's who I got it through. I'll have to go check. But I did I did order it through, I think it was Entertainment Earth. So, uh, All right. So now we are going to get into the Jankies. Two of them. So 
and uh, I'm I, I'm hoping they do something more. They do another uh, Carnage run in comics because he is. I love the character, and I know I know people are saying he's getting he gets a little played out, just like uh, the Batman who laughs. But he's such a great character. All right, so let's see here. Oh, dropping stickers. Hold on, folks. I think we already have this one. Oh man, my back is killing me. I hurt my. I mean, I like, strained my back. Hey, Mama J, how you doing? Thank you for coming by. Thank you guys. Got nineteen in here. Hell yeah! So here's the sticker. I think we have like two of these out of the last one. Um, and I did pick up a, a sticker board for my boy. We're gonna put it up in his room, and he is going to add um, all of the stickers that he gets. Uh, he was super excited. And I'm gonna give him any duplicates I have um, from from people that I get them. He's gonna put them on his board as well. So here we go. Let's see what we got. Oh, I think no, we do not have this one. So here we go. Wearing his little white tank top and he's got glasses. Oh man, nice. Get in here and, and put these glasses on here. I am, I, you know, I, I I swore to myself I wouldn't get into, and then, ooh, I'll tell you, I've never gotten frustrated to it really about getting stuff. There's been times where like I've gotten frustrated with with some stuff about like trying to get boxes, uh, certain mystery boxes. Like at the beginning, I used to get I used to get frustrated with the whole not being able to get a Pop King Paul box, but then after a couple times, I'm like, well, I guess it's just not in my cards. Today they dropped the new. Uh, go the the new tiny ghost i wanted that thing it was the ouija board one i wanted it literally i was on the screen refreshing at 159 or whatever it was 12 59 because it dropped at whatever time i was there a couple minutes early refreshing 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 and nothing as soon as it came up it was already sold out so i was like god dang it so uh that kind of sucked i was frustrated because i wanted to get that bad boy then that's the only one i really I'm trying to not go down these. Uh, Mama Jane, my son is five years old. He's five, going to be six next month. He'll be six on August 21st. Yeah, I mean, I know that's the problem. That's the same sticker we just got. So I'm going to leave that one on the ground for now. I'll pick it up after the stream. Uh, I, I guess. I know I think it was like limited to only 350. And, they, and I... But I don't know if it's bots or the fact that people love those things. Um, yeah, my daughter. Yeah, sorry, Mama Jay. My daughter is 18, and uh, she is going, oh, what is this one? What is this one? Did we, did we just get, oh, yes. I think we just got one of the mystery ones. Dude, that is awesome. And he's got, they've got, like, I'll, I'm not going to put all this, I mean, you know what, hell, screw it. We're here now, right? Oh, man, this is so cool, man. This one is so freaking cool. And it's, it's am I wrong in saying that? It, it's, yeah, right? Oh, my God, that's so sweet. Is it super rare? I don't know. I'm having trouble. I'm on a struggle bus here. All right, I'm gonna. I'll wait. I'll I'll screw around with that later because I'll sit here and <laughs> completely forget that I'm doing something else. But that is awesome. Um, like, oh man, he's gonna be so excited because we got the I guess the chase version. Of uh, we got the chase version of of this guy here. My son has that, and then he has this one up on his uh, dresser right now. So he really wants the uh, he really wants the frog one or this one right here. He calls it the he calls it the frog one. Well, we've got a bunch more because I'm doing about two to three weeks. So we opened, I opened three here on the stream. I let him have two of them. We did two on 
Instagram. So that's five, seven. I mean, I've got uh, 15 more. So, or 17 more. There's 24 total. So we'll be opening them up over the few, next few weeks for sure. So we'll, we'll see. All right, let's see. Now we're going to get into some auction wins. Um, yeah, my son likes the donut one too, but for, I don't know. He calls it the uh, the frog one. Like I said, he likes the donut one. He likes the frog one. And then is this – so this must be – this one must be like the uh, – how's it going, Dead Zone Man? Thank you for coming by. Thank you, thank you. Um, must be the, the variant or like oh, variant. the chase version of this guy right here at the top, this lady. I'm not sure. So that's sweet. I'll, I'll put her together and I'll take all my photos before I go to bed and put all the stuff up on, uh, on Instagram. Uh, it's janky. Uh, it is, these are Jenkies series two from super plastic. Um, they, they did a sale and it was like half off. So I was like, I've been trying to avoid getting into anything other than Funko Pops and comics. And I saw this on sale and I've seen other people post it on Instagram. So I was like, oh, it's like, it's half price. I'm like, what the hell? Let's grab a box. So this is an auction win from Mike Rogers. Uh, Mike Rogers is a cool guy. I love his channel. If you guys are into comic books and you want to know, like, when awesome variant covers or awesome deals like Peach Momoko covers, uh, when Scotty Young's dropping different stuff, um, when J. Scott Campbell's dropping stuff, when when these artists are dropping, you know they have special stuff going out, um, or you know, or there's pre-order stuff, or like the 15 different covers that came out. I know it wasn't really 15, but they had a bunch of different covers for um, for. Venom 26 and he he puts up this the he, the steals and deals of comics all the different things. I've got my my top bar full of different websites because of him and I've landed some cool uh cool stuff. So I've gotten the uh Strange Academy Virgin variant that I sent to CGC. I have another copy signed that should be here in a couple weeks. So Let's get into these. These were all, um, I believe these were all independent books and like uh, one cut, uh, number ones. So here we go. It didn't go very far. So, all right, here we go. All right, so this is Baby Teeth, uh, number one. Oh, man, that had some mega, mega glare there. So, uh, I don't know. I mean, I'm probably I'm gonna probably read this one and check it out. I'm not big into um, the devil stuff or like um, antichrist stuff, and I think that's kind of what this is. So I don't know. That's not the book I wanted out of this lot. We've got good old. Bang number one. And then Redneck number one. This is another Donnie Cates. Which I haven't read this one. I wanna I wanna check this series out. Because I'm liking what Donnie Cates is doing. So you know I, I'm liking what he's doing with Venom and I'm liking what he's doing with um with Thor, and then apparently he did the death of the inhuman, so I gotta read that story run. Uh, and then we've got Philadelphia, number one. Right? Yeah. So these are all I think these are all number one covers. And again, what Mike's been doing is he's been getting into doing uh his auctions uh with stuff that he's bought. So oh yeah, this is an awesome book here. This is the old guard. Number one and number two. I was happy to get this and then realized because again, I don't follow like all the the news and everything that stuff's coming to uh, uh, 
well, I have not as much until recently, um, but to see that that was a um, that was a Netflix movie that I just watched, and I'll tell you, the movie's awesome. Charlize Theron does a great job, so I was excited that I got these from Mike. And what's funny is my daughter, who doesn't care about comics, uh, she watched the movie. I was checking in with her last night, just talking to her about some of the stuff that's coming up with college, and she's like, oh, hey. She's like, there's a new movie on uh, Netflix, The Old Guard. It's awesome. Have You I, You need to watch it. I'm like, haha, I beat you to it. I've already seen it. She's like, yeah, and then I found out it was a comic. And I, I was like, I got to read this thing. So she asked me, she's like, do you have any? I'm like, well, actually, I have a couple coming because I knew I had Mike's order. So I bumped him up in the line to open his stuff tonight so that she can uh, – tomorrow read the uh, first two issues and then i told her uh digitally she can she can read the other ones if she wants so and then we got undiscovered country number one i actually have this double signed so it's cool to have a book another one again i haven't read this series yeah newbie i loved it man i, I love the movie and if, if the comics like the movie like if it's along those lines i'm gonna i'm gonna enjoy the hell out of the comic and then you've got uh, the beautiful Gwen Stacy, number one. So, so there we go. And then some nice little board to protect it. We've got Nebula, number one. I'm gonna try to go through these a little quick because I got a big box still from uh, Mike the Collector. I got to get into, and we're already at 43 minutes. So, trees number one. And then this is Mercy, the Virgin Variant. I love, you guys know how I like my Virgin Variants. So this is Mercy, <laughs> number one Virgin Variant. And then oh, I'm going to do Plot. I got two copies of Plot number one, so you know what that means. This will probably be in one of the giveaways, upcoming giveaways, one of these. I heard this book is really good, so I'm going to check it out and see, uh, see what happens with it. And then... I would say one of my favorite stories going on right now, this is the Virgin Variant of book number one of Something is Killing the Children. So I'm I'm super happy about this. I thought about, I th this is in good shape, man. I think I think I may end up, yeah, because it's, I may end up having this pressed and get it slabbed because I have, I have the rest. Um... <sighs> I have the rest of the series uh, now. I end up getting the other books in the series. Plus, I have um, I have one that is getting uh, slabbed right now as well. That it just went with my second order of CGC. So, holy crap! This is a bit. This is a right mailer that is chock full of books. Mike the Collector, he is awesome. He is pretty much getting rid of a lot of his stuff. He wants to keep his X Men and just the pure X Men. No more variant covers and all that. So. He's been selling. Uh, I use um, my first order. I had CGC do the pressing, uh, which they add like $12. Uh, but my LCS, he actually does pressing himself. So he said that because I have a subscription with him, he'll do he'll do each book each book for five bucks. So uh, you know that's that's uh, that's not bad. So. Um, Oh, uh, what the deuce, man. Horror is my favorite genre. I'm not big into, like the, like I said, the satanic stuff or the, um, I'm shaking my desk, the the Antichrist, because I say satanic stuff because I'm not sure. I The Everglade Angels, I really liked that first one. So, uh, you know, <laughs> I, that's like a cultish kind of thing. We'll see how that plays out. But I'm not big into, like, the Antichrist stuff. But horror stuff, I love it. Like, something's eating the children. Love it. Uh, the year zero. Love it. Um, what else am I, what else are we looking at? Just a bunch of different, uh, I'm really loving everything. And then it, nail biter. I love that. I know that's not really technically horror, but Hey, what is up? Silent decay. Thank you for coming by, man. So yeah, with Mike, the collector, I think, I mean, this was, I mean, I paid a decent amount for this, but it is full of Jesus. So this is a bunch of books, and I believe this is a mixture of Venom, different runs of Venom, some Spider-Man stuff. Uh, so 
Oh, I have um, I have the first two, the first two or three coming. Lady Fantastic um, had some in one of the auctions. I think it was the first two issues. I picked up both of those because I've had I have that on my list of what I want to check out. And I heard Gideon Falls. I, that's why I bought the trade paperback of Gideon Falls because I heard that's a pretty, pretty crazy book. So. Oh, he's got these all in different. Holy crap. So we got these are must these are was this this was Mike the Collector, right? No, this was Shorty. Oh, okay. Well, we're open Shorty's box. I believe this is Shorty's box. Because like, wait a minute, I don't think I think it was all on one night. Well, we've got Shorty's box, so we're gonna open that. And these were from different auctions, different auction nights. Um, over time, you can build boxes with them. You pay the $15 shipping, and they can go up to like 45, uh, 45 books in one box. So, oh, man. I already got some, uh, some stuff on here. Got some geeky mama bear action going on here. So let's see here. Let's get into these first little books here. Yeah, Keith Titus. I like Stephen King too. I just wish they would do his uh, the adaptations. They would do his books more justice with adaptations. That is what I grew up on. My mom's a huge Stephen King uh, fan. I remember. I think like one of the first books I read, like big 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 books, was uh, Tommy Knockers, and then The Stand and all those. So all right, so here we go. Um, we've got. Deadpool the end number one. We've got the Immortal Hulk number. Oh, well, this is a run. I'm going backwards on this run. Immortal Hulk number eleven. I'm going to kind of go through this a little quick because we're already at forty eight minutes. We've got number ten of Immortal Hulk. This is another series I'm probably going to get into uh, because I did get. Um, I got a little run here, and I got another run from somebody else. So then you got number nine. Like that. And then here is number six. So. All righty. So which one do I want to open up first? Which one? This one feels. Yeah, we'll go with this one. This, I'm feeling this one a little bit more right now. There we go. Let's check these out. Oh, man, that's a nice book. <clears throat> oh, this has got two bricks here. So books, books, and more books. That's one thing, like, with these. I think what I'm going to do is for time-wise from now on, like, I've got three three more boxes like this. One's from Mike the Collector. One is from Lady Fan, Fantastic. And then I have another one up there. I'm not sure who the other one is from. Um, I think I'm going to do, like, just do, like, my LCS pickups a couple jankies, and then if I have like one of uh, whenever the uh, pop in a box comes, I think if it comes next week, I'm just gonna do that. So it's not so long drawn out, and we can jump right into. I uh, took the tape right off of that. All right, so here we go with these ones. Oh yeah, we got some venom here. Venom 151 fighting the T Rex. Gotta love that. Hey Kenneth Bird, how you doing, man? I didn't even see you pop in there. How are you doing, man? So oh, we got some The End, Miles Morales. I've been digging his comic. Oh, don't worry. Don't worry, Geeky. Don't worry, Juliana. Um, we got this one. That one. Hold on. If you're going to stick, stick around for one second, we got some more. Um, we got, we got a few more. So we've got some good old Spider-Man Deadpool. If you haven't read this story, Geeky Mama Bear, I, I suggest you read these guys' story together because it is, it is hilarious. I love their interactions together. 
So this is awesome. Spider-Man Deadpool. This is the first appearance, by the way, of Itsy Bitsy. And then we've got this one because Miss 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 Geeky Mama Bear. Because with the claims, I'm on my phone, and I don't know my internet. I mean, I, I think. I mean, I thought I had good internet. Trying to do the claims anytime, you know, anytime like Deadpool goes up, uh, something like that. I know I'm not going to get. I know I'm not going to get it. I try, so um, I missed out on a couple. So. Shorty, Shorty sent me a message. Said, "Hey, I've got a couple books um, that you know if you want them." So she she offered this one to me. It is Deadpool number six. I love this one. So there's that one, and I know I think I have some more Deadpool in here, but those were the ones that were in this little lot. So. Uh, then we got more Venom because she decided she wanted to part ways with Venom because if you guys know Shorty, she loves Venom. Uh, it is, yeah, this is not the A cover. Yeah, this is not the A cover. It's a variant. So then, oh, we got another Dark Hawk. Oh, we got another Dark Hawk number two. So I just pulled, I already have Dark Hawk 1 through 10, and I just got another number one in a mystery box. So I might throw those together in uh, in in a giveaway. So then we've got, oh, two of my favorite dudes, Carnage and Venom. This is Spider-Man 202. Love it. And this is part of the Maximum Carnage. This is 9 to 14. I think I finally, because I think I bought... From Mike Rogers, I bought some other books too that uh, that would complete that fourteen part series. We got a Fantastic Four, two eighty seven. So I'm going to go through these real quick, guys, uh, so that we can get into the giveaways and everyone can go on with the rest of their evening. And I can go to bed. You got Lady Death. And then another Venom. This is a Venom at the End. Man, I just I love his character, man. And then, all right, let's get to this next because I still have another bag of books I got to open from her here too that came in the box. So, oh yeah, here we go. So I'm loving it. I I think I finally uh, the only the only Venom book the only Venom book that I have not gotten yet is number three, and I don't know. <laughs> At this point, I don't think, unless I get it in a mystery box, I don't think I'm going to get a number three because of how much money that thing is going right now. So here we go. We've got a Captain America. This is the first appearance of Mother Superior, who's the daughter of the Red Skull. That's pretty cool. So this is number uh, 290. It's, it's beat up. It, this is definitely a, a rough copy, but still, it was nice to have. It's going to be nice to have in the collection. You've got the second appearance of Nuke here on Daredevil. This is Daredevil 233. These ones were a little bit older, which is fine with me. I, I, I like the older books. Oh. oh, man, it's it's blowing. It's it's insane. It is so insane right now, Flash Ray. Um, hell, who somebody put it up. I can't remember who put it up in auction, but they threw it up, and the thing was over... Uh, <laughs> Over $160, $170 or something like that. Then we got uh, Avengers Occupy. I don't know. Yeah, this is an Avengers story. Then you got Power Man and Iron Fist. Mr. Luke Cage. Still sad that they canceled Daredevil. And they canceled Jessica Jones, and they canceled Luke Cage. Although I understand why Iron Fist canceled that all day. That was that was just I, I think they miscast. Um, they did miscast Danny Rand. We got Nightcrawler here, like this dude, and then oh yeah, adding another Thor to my to my collection. This is four forty one. It is cheap. 
Um, I think it was because there wasn't a lot. I think it was the first lot that he was putting up or the first, first book he put up. So there wasn't a lot of people yet in the chat. But uh, And then we got another another Mighty Thor. Yeah, I love my Thor, man. Love Thor. I'll tell you what. It's insane. Talking about we're talking about Venom three. How about Thor five? The the fact that it's a it's a it, the standard cover. Um, it's this the A cover. Uh, three ninety nine book. You got it. I bought one. I thought about buying two. I bought one. That book has completely sold out because it is the first appearance, the first full appearance of Black Winter. I do have a, a the the uh, Virgin variant co- um, of number five coming, so I'm hoping. Uh, I'm, I mean, I'm going to get that one. I'm going to keep them. I, and again, I collect to collect. I'm not looking to sell. Um, you know, I'm not looking to sell. So if I'm buying something, I'm buying it for my collection. So it, it's crazy with some of this stuff. You know, it's a it's a regular A cover, three ninety nine dollar cover price, and. You know, people are people are swiping that thing off left and right. They're all they're all completely sold out. And so I think the only thing that's left, there's a bunch of number ones left of the different thing. Yeah, I wasn't collecting yet. I mean, that's the thing. So, um, yeah, I mean, and and it, it, the the cool thing is the this this storyline that Donny Cates is doing. I love it. I love the whole. You know, you've got. You've got Galactus coming in, and you know, spoiler alert: uh, Thor becomes a herald, the herald of thunder. For uh, oh yeah, they'll reprint it for sure. But I mean, again, it's like they're, they're of course they're going to reprint it. They're going to probably do a second and a third reprint because of how how much they it sold. So we go. I got oh, we got. Did we get a? Did I get this twice? I think it's the second one. Oh, yeah. We've got two. Maybe giveaway. I didn't realize I got two of them. That'll that'll be a that possibly giveaway right there, right? Or it might find its way on its way to somebody. So then here we go. The Mighty Thor number one. Jane Foster as Thor. I love this storyline too, and the War of the Realms. Those are awesome storylines. I really enjoy those. And then the last one of this group is got some She-Hulk, the Avengers, Earth's Mightiest Heroes. All right, now let's get into this last box because we are at an hour. I want to get into these giveaways so everyone can uh, can go about the rest of their evening and all that. So let's let's get into this last one. See what it is because I can't remember. I can't remember a lot of the stuff I got because I think this was over like two, three weeks worth time of just getting stuff, uh, you know, claiming stuff, buying, you know, buying some of her, you know, getting some of the auctions and whatnot. Um, this damn blue tape, man. Pull tabs, guys. Pull tabs are your friend. It did. It did. But whenever I'm sitting here, I mean, I'm having a good time. I didn't realize it. Like, I, I'm, I'm, I'm glad to have the timer here on StreamYard just to let me know, because I could sit here. I see why people stream for five, six hours, um, especially if you have guests on. Which, again, eventually I want to end up doing. I want to get some people on here uh, that have stuff and kind of do like a a haul video kind of thing, like a haul live stream. Because I think that'd be a little bit more fun than doing this all by myself. K tie is K tie, man. I, we are competitive. We are a competitive household. I do not like to lose. Um, do not like to lose, man. All right, so we got Web of Venom, Funeral Pyre. No, you were not late. You were not late. Six and six, and then here is Web of Venom. Venam, number one. Yeah, here we go. We got we got a lot more. So this is number four. This is Venom first host. 
And this is first cover appearance of Sleeper, second appearance of Sleeper. I like that. I like how they put the little notes on there. Good job. Good job, Shorty. I am I am on my fifth short box flash ray. Uh, just because one is now it, one is pretty much full of my Thor stuff, and then I have one that's full of indie. Oh, okay, no, I'm on I'm on three. I'm about to go on to number four. Hey, chubby pop chaser, how you doing, man? Thank you for coming by. And we got number one Venom annual. Oh, Cowboys fan, I feel sorry for you. So, <laughs> it's all right. My wife, my wife is a Giants fan. So, it's all right. Listen, I'm a Cleveland Browns fan, so I have no room to say anything about any team. How how bad we've been for how long? We're starting to look like we might get. We're getting there, and then you know we kind of crapped the bed last season, and then you got Web of Venom, the Good Son. You got Dylan Brock, which. Yep, she's got Dylan Brock possessed by the Goblin symbiote. So, love my Cleveland Browns. I love my Cleveland Indians. I hope they don't change the name. Uh, who knows? I know the Redskins officially said they are retiring the Redskins name, and they're, cha they're changing that. Man, no. No. No, no. I, 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 he's gone after this year. He's gone after this year. So... He's got to get gone. He's got to be gone because he's he's a, such a drama queen. And then we got uh, 164 Venom. I know Joe M. Man, my Cleveland, my Cleveland brother. Although born and raised Floridian, love Cleveland because my dad my 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 dad is from the area. My mom is from Erie, Pennsylvania. She was closer to Cleveland than Pittsburgh, so she grew up more of a Cleveland fan. Um, one thing I regret, I wish I could have gotten up to Jacob's Field with my dad before he had passed away because anytime they were down here in Winter Haven uh, for spring training, we would go over and we'd watch their games and everything. So then we got some more Venom here. So, man, I did not realize how many books. And then we <laughs> more Venom, Tangled Webs. Wow, Steelers, what the deuce. And that's the thing. Half my family, uh, half my family, is Pittsburgh, and the other half is Cleveland. Um, my cousin, who we're on business partners with, he's a huge Steelers fan, uh, so I have to hear it all the time. <laughs> that's funny. Well, I mean, that's even like they were talking about Florida State with the Seminoles. It's like you can't listen. The Seminoles were actually a tribe here in Florida, so it's like. Then we got some more venom. This is the land before crime. This is number one fifty-two. Gotta hurry up and get through these. And then here we go, venom number ten. We got some Dylan Brock down here. I'm I'm curious to see how they're gonna what they're gonna do with Dylan, because um, I know he's he's trying to figure his stuff out. So it's gonna be interesting to see how they incorporate him. And I just want to see the stuff made into movies, man. I love oh, Tim uh, Tebow, man. I'll tell you, kid, kid ha is talented, talented. Not a good quarterback though. Not an NFL quarterback. I'll say that he's not an NFL quarterback. Uh, so, wait a minute. He's selling. Hmm, that's interesting, because I just pulled that out of a mystery box, and I didn't think. Oh, no, no, no disrespect. I got you what to do, man. Listen, I, like I said, half half my family is Pittsburgh. Well, actually, I would say majority of my family is Pittsburgh, but then you have us black sheep in the family who are Cleveland fans. So, and then you got Immortal Hulk number four. Got a Venom number uno. Acts of Evil. 
And then, oh, here we go. This is the Miles Morales Venom cover. I actually like this one. This is number 22, which is the John Tyler Christopher variant, which is cover B. I really like I, I like these different covers, man. Hundred percent agree, Chubby. Hundred uh, percent agree. I remember when he was playing high school ball. Um, our our local high school played against them, and the kid did not quit. Man, the kid he he fought hard, and you knew what you're getting with him. You knew you were getting the option run. You you knew you're getting that with him. So you know, I give that to him. So you got Venom, and then we got Venom number fifteen. I like this one with the mirror. This is the uh, Simone Mianchi variant. Oh, yeah, that's right, Bearded Barbarian. You're you're a Patriots fan. Now we got Brady and Gronk down here in Tampa. It's got to be rough for you guys. And what's going to be even worse is Brady is going to lead the, the Bucks to the playoffs. Hate to say it, Patriots are going to miss the playoffs because I think the Bills and the Jets, I'm going to say that, and the Jets are going to beat them in the division just because – I don't think they – oh, no, 100% it's old news. But I don't think they have a quarterback. And, yes, as much as Belichick – I think Belichick is a mastermind, 100%. Uh, I just don't think they have somebody who can be implemented into that system. Um, You laugh, Flash Ray. You laugh. But you never know. You never know. I'm, I'm just – that's my that's – my, that's my crazy pick for this year, the Jets. I could have said the Dolphins, but I think the Jets are going to surprise some people. I don't, I don't think, I don't think they're great, but yeah, you know what though? They got Cam, but Cam is injury prone, um, and he's. I don't think Cam is going to fit into Belichick's system. I thought it was weird that they went and got him, and they didn't try to go get somebody like Teddy Bridgewater because I think Teddy Bridgewater would have thrived in the. In the uh, in that system up there, because he's a pocket passer, he he can work those medium to short range passes. Um, Kenneth Bird, we will not talk about the Baltimore Ravens. Although I ate my words, I ate crow about Lamar Jackson because I said after his rookies here, I'm like, yeah, yeah, they're gonna figure him out. They're gonna figure him out. <laughs> Quick draw with the sorry. Listen, I I, I'm, I have many interests, sports, comics, collectibles, all that fun stuff. But I will say this, and then we'll get through uh, – oh, you're we'll get through the rest of these books, and then we'll do our giveaways. Um, Lamar Jackson, man, he's legit. So, all right, then we got Venom number 11. This is the origin of uh, Dylan Brock. This is second printing. I, yeah, I, I I I see you on that, bearded. But the problem is, I don't think Cam's a good fit for them. I'm just saying. Then we got Venom number twelve. And then ah, uh, here we go. This is the Greg Horn Venom twenty five. Yeah, the Venom twenty five cover. 100%. Lamar Jackson, he blew me away last year, and I think he's only going to get better. And I'll eat my words because I said it when he came out. I was like, eh, he might, he's a little overrated. And then even after his rookie year, I was like, ah, oh, let's not get too excited about him. And then Immortal Hulk with the Carnage cover, uh, Absolute Carnage cover, and uh, that's number one. Yeah. War Machine Venom. So... I like that book. And then you got the Immortal Hulk number one. This is the director cut. And then the last book, right? Yeah, the last book in this lot is Venom Acts of Evil number one. I think this is a different, yeah, this is a different cover than what I had. So we finally made it through all those books. These, <laughs> holy hell, we've got some books. So now I got to sort through these. Then I got to file them away. So, man. So, again, this fits into, I don't know exactly how much I spent over time on these. $15 mailed for this, this brick of books. And, again, I'll have to sort them, put them in my, in my boxes and everything like that. So, 
thank you guys for hanging around. We are 18 strong. Again, thank you guys so much. And K Titus, Japanese baseball, I love it. I love watching. Uh, I, I loved watching Ichiro when he was over there playing. And then when he signed with the Mariners, I thought it was so cool. I thought it was so cool because I, I thought Ichiro uh, coming in was MVP material uh, for sure. And he was awesome. So, yeah, flash rate. I, I try to keep it, and that's and that's part of my thing is like why I've even contemplated moving up my time to um, ten o'clock and even nine thirty, uh, so that I don't have to. Because um, I I can't. I'm I'm very bad about. It. I don't want to leave my office a mess with the boxes, so I got to break everything down. I got to clean up the bubble wrap if I'm key. I reuse bubble wrap, so I got to clean all that stuff up, and then I got to sort my boxes. So I got to go through and sort them all. So. Let's uh, let's get into this stuff here. All right, so this is the weekly giveaway. This is the weekly giveaway. Just, just some books. Um, we've got Superman or Supergirl. Then you got uh, the. Oh my God, Suicide Squad. Jeez, look at the cover, dummy. Suicide Squad 49 variant cover. Limit a, a, a minimal variant. Uh, and then I've got two Justice League uh, Aquaman, Jason Momoa covers. Because, you know, hey, listen, Jason Momoa, he's a good looking dude, right? And then uh, Superman Aliens, the three part series. This was such a fun crossover read. I really liked it. So that is. Going in the box, you guys will get that. Why are they showing a fight from last week? Are they just showing highlights? So that'll go in a mailer. I mean, that's going to go in the Gemini. We're going to throw it in the mailer, and that'll go out to the winner tomorrow. Um, no, can't buy that one. All right, so let's get into here. Let's share the screen, why don't we, right? Uh, so click here, start sharing. What do I want to share? I'm going to do a tab. Uh, let's see what wheel this is. Let's see, share. My, oh my God. Okay, there we go. No, that's not what I wanted to share. That's the chat. My popped out chat. Why the hell did it share that? So let's remove that real quick. Oh, man. No, I didn't want to stop sharing. What am I doing here? Share screen. Jesus. Technical difficulties here, folks. Yeah, uh, silent. I want to end up picking that one up, too, and checking that out after reading the, uh, the Superman aliens. All right, so here we go. Wheel of Names share. Is this the one... I'm back. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Um, 
Excuse me. Sorry about that. No offense to anybody. I don't mean to offend anybody there. All right. So, oh, man. Uh, yeah, that's two weeks in a row, man. It's two weeks in a row. Uh, <laughs> oh, frustrating. Frustrating. You know, you pay you pay for the highest end of it. Um, thankfully, I know that they're putting in the, the freaking fiber optics. So maybe I can upgrade to a different company because the company we have here is got like a monopoly. And you're supposed to, I'm supposed to have the highest level of it. So I'm back. <laughs> so uh, let's see here. Um, I'm going to try to share the screen again. Uh, holy hell, that sucked. I just want to make sure I click the right one. All right, that's the one for the 250. This one is for, are they, uh, what? Are they, uh, no? No, please tell me they didn't both. Mother of God. All right, so bear with me real quick so I pull up my email and I can pull this copy. I'm just going to make it um, as quick as possible. I'm not going to I'm not going to go back in. I had I had both wheels set up, man. Now I'm mad. Now, now I'm freaking pissed. God dang it. Uh, oh, bear with me. Bear with me as I sit here and I pull up my email, try to recover from this ridiculousness and everything. So, yeah, joys. So, sip on some coffee here. Dribble a little bit on myself. Yay. Oh, my God. I'm going to try to lose my lose my mind. Yeah, I have Spectrum. We have Spectrum here. So, it's like, they piss me off. Let's see here. All right. Pull up this giveaway list real quick. It's a good thing I typed these things out beforehand and I, I have it on a save file um, so that it makes it so much freaking easier. I don't have to worry about it. So bear with me, folks. Again, it wouldn't be, it would not be me, average Will, if we didn't have freaking issues, right? So, come on. Waiting for this to load up because everything's trying to wake the hell back up. Insane. Yes, yes. Insert the music. Do, 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 do. Oh, is my coffee mug draining from being in the. Ah. Uh. So, dang it, man. So, I think it's up. So, I'm leaking freaking water out of the bottom of the cup, man. I tell my daughter, don't put these in the, don't put these in the dishwasher. She still does. And they freaking hold water, these tumblers. What are we doing here? What is this? That's the, that's the chat. That's you guys broken out. Somebody said hi to me. Hey, Candyman Rip, how you doing, man? How is it going? Uh, so let's see here. Why is that not open? All right, let me do this. Because I know I downloaded it already earlier. I'm mad because I had the whole list. And now it's not one to cooperate with me. I don't want to just jump into the um, 250 giveaway list. So this needs to quit being a pain in my butt and start cooperating with me. so mad what is going on here load up man there we go i'm just gonna open it this way download it that way there we go uh so how's everyone else doing tonight <laughs> hope everyone's having a good night uh i am on the struggle bus right now so let's see what we got here Oh my god, this is taking forever, folks. I'm sorry. Sorry for the delay. Thank you guys for bearing with me here. Um, man. Uh 
Ah, this is it's really starting to <laughs> it's really starting to annoy me here. So uh Oh man, you're giving two books away? Nice. Yeah. That's awesome. So here we go. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. All right. I think we've got it figured out, I'm hoping. All right. Here we go. Let's copy. Do, 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 do. That's all right. Let's go copy. Mm. Copy. I think I'm going to need to upgrade my computer as well. I think that might be some of the problem. I'm running on a computer that's a few years old, so it's uh, she's being very temperamental. Uh, so let's go in here. Let's see here. Let's do this. Let's delete all these. Delete. Oh, man. Somebody's putting up some Thor books. What are you doing to me, comic book poser? I like that guy. If you guys, if you guys haven't watched any comic book poser stuff, I like his stuff. He he does, you know, the new release stuff. And uh, what? What are you doing to me here? Copy. Oh, because I didn't do enable editing, maybe. Oh, sometimes you just, things don't want to work out the way that, that you hope they work out. So you got to improvise a little bit. So again, thank you guys for hanging out with me here, trying to get this going so we can get the, uh, this giveaway rocking and rolling here for you guys. Minimize that. Let's add that in there. Oh, do not crash on me again. I will lose my mind. Okay, we were about to about to see some average Will Hulk moment there, man. Holy crap, this is this is getting annoying. So I'm gonna see here. Let's go. Uh, Bam box five. Take that out of there, and then popular opinion box battle from last night from yesterday. Glad to see everyone is enjoying our box battles. Uh, it is, uh, you know what, I'm going to add the images here just because I did it last time. So again, with the weekly giveaway, uh, I'm going to do it every week. Uh, we're going to have everybody's names. When you comment on a video, your name will go on the wheel. Uh, it will it will enter you into um, the weekly giveaway, and you'll have an opportunity to win what I'm giving away, which is comics, Funko Pops, and the, and the fun stuff. Uh, also on the wheel will be uh, each of my logos. So you'll have one logo, which this week it's going to be the red logo. If it lands on the red logo, it is going to be something added to it. Who knows? I might take one of the comics that we just opened up tonight and throw a couple of those comics in there, uh, or it might be something else. And then if it lands on the blue logo, uh, that logo will get you a $25 gift card. So, and then we're, we're going to respin it. You know, if it lands on there, it's added to the pile, and then we'll respin it and whoever lands it. So you have a chance if we if you land on both of my logos, you, those are each going to be added into the uh, the giveaway. So it's pretty 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 interesting, pretty pretty fun thing I wanted to do for you guys as a way to uh, <laughs> quick draw down for raging will. Nice. Oh man. All right, so let's get the right wheel up. That is the 250 giveaway. That is the first one. So let's get back in here. Got my fingers crossed, folks. Let's see. Let it. Let's let's share the screen here. Let's see. Let's see. Let's share the screen. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, hey, Taz, how you doing, man? Thank you for coming by. Tats, sorry, I called you Taz. Let's share, please. Please. Oh, thank goodness. Uh, so let's let's make this big. I'm gonna make this big for you guys so you don't have to see my ugly mug. But I gotta figure out a way to make it full screen. I don't know why why on mine 
it's this is how big it gets. It's weird. It's weird. It's a little annoying. So go in here. Let's give it a spinny spin or shuffle. I mean, we're gonna shuffle it three times. And let's spin. See who's gonna win the comic books for the regular weekly giveaway. And the winner is Candyman Rip. Awesome. You have won Candyman. If you're still in here, go ahead and shoot me a DM um, on Instagram. Uh, God, that's so... Is it coming in that sh crappy quality for you guys? I hope not. Let me see here. Let me click over here. See how it's coming in. So, and I'm lagging real bad, right? So, Candyman, hit me up on uh, Instagram. Just send me your shipping info, and I will uh, I'll send this stuff out to you. So let's go ahead and close this one, and let's stop sharing this one. Stop screen. Get my my mug back on here. All righty. So that one is done. Congratulations, Candyman. You are the giveaway winner. I had sticky notes. Here we go. Some sticky notes. <laughs> I like that chubby. Chubby chaser. I like it. Chubby pop chaser. All right. So candy man. Candy man. Candy man. Uh, here we go. Next box. Put that. That'll go. I'll just clear that up. I might need to, yeah, you're right. Chuck it in the chuck it in the lake. All right, so now the the 250 sub giveaway. I know every the reason why everyone wanted to come by. So here is what I, I do you guys want me to show the, the comics first or the pops first? Because it's a mixture of both. So I'll let you guys tell me. I'm in I'm in StreamYard. This is this is, uh, get the live chat up here. I got Pops, Pop. All right, so I saw Pops, so we're going to go with Pops. Pops, then best for last. I don't know. I don't know, Miss Amanda. Um, you might like these Pops. You, I think you have a, a couple of these. So we'll show the Pops first. So we'll uh, first pop is Rogue, and this is going to go in a sorter in the box. Uh, I just haven't fully packed everything. Then we've got Gambit, yeah, because you, you saw it. I took the picture and posted it on my Instagram. So you got Gambit, and then the other pop is the E Triple C. It's con exclusive toad. So this is the other pop that's going to be in there. So all three of these are going to go. So I wanted to make it a theme. I thought it was pretty fun uh, building the theme. So we've got, here's the comics now. You've got X-Man. We've got X-Men number one, because everybody should have a copy of this. You've got Uncanny, uh, un, Uncanny X Men 300. Some shiny shininess. And then we've got X Factor. I know it's not X Men, but it's got, it's got X Men on the front. It is, it's an X, it's the next title. It's signed. I butcher this guy's name every time. It's Wils Pitchard. So it is signed down here in silver. Uh, by the, the artist. And then, last but not least, is X-Men 1 variant cover signed by the man himself, Chris Claremont. 
Is that what it is, what to do? Yeah, I could not say his last. I'm, I'm horrible with names anyways. So, it is X-Men heavy. This is signed. Here is the COA of it. See there? Number one by Chris Claremont. The date he signed it was May of last year. Torpedo comic. So, that is... Uh, that is the box. So I hope you guys are excited about it. I had fun putting it together. This is for two fifty. I can't wait. I mean, I've already pretty much got the things figured out. I've already got the four consolation prizes uh, sitting over in my giveaway box for when we hit five hundred. The grand prize for that, the number one prize for five, because I'm giving at least five. Right now, I've got five. That I've got figured out for 500. That's why I want to get to 500. I want to give these stuff to you guys. Uh, so yeah, let's. That that's what it is. I hope you guys. Hope you guys are excited. I hope I did a good job putting it together. Um, definitely, definitely want to to give back to you guys because you guys support me. You know, and and it was awesome because the question was that on the giveaway video was, how did you come to be a subscriber of mine. I wanted to hear all the stories and hearing who sent you, you know, like a lot of people from Wink, you had other, you know, some people came from Crazy Clown. Uh, some people were sent over by others. Some people found me through Instagram, which I thought was cool. Saw other people said, hey, you came up in my recommended recommended uh, videos. And that, that was awesome, man, to hear that stuff. So that, that meant a lot to me because again, I, I've gotten the shout outs. I've gotten the boosts from other individuals, which has been awesome. Uh, and I'm, I'm forever grateful for those guys. So it was really, it was really awesome to hear how everyone kind of came to find my channel and to subscribe to me. So, um, that is, that is, uh, that is why I wanted to do this. And again, I'm going to do, I thought about doing themes and I haven't forgotten. We are going to do next week's giveaway is a pop giveaway and it is going to be a Harry Potter pop. I know not everyone's thrilled about Harry Potter. It is Mr. Cedric Diggory from the Goblet of Fire with the shared exclusive with the uh, special edition sticker. So that is going to be the giveaway for next week. So again, how do you enter in next week? You comment on my videos. It's as simple as that. It's as simple as that. So, all right, but uh, all right. So let's get into it. Let's let's fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Let's let's share the screen here. Fingers crossed. Let's see. Let's go tab. I need to get my. I need to have it set up. Um, I need to have my my dual monitor set up to where I can run it all straight off of one PC. It's like irritating me. So here we go. Uh, Wheel of names. Let's get it open here. Hold. Comment, comment, comment. You got it, Mike. It's when this post, when this goes live, or when this, uh, pro, you know, when this goes uh, goes live, drop a comment on here, and then comment on my video tomorrow, which is a comic book uh, video. I open a mainstream box. Saturday, I do, uh, I think it's the, the Bam Box Horror Box number five. Um, and then next Tuesday is a battle box with the wife. We're doing Poptopia boxes. It was a fun video. Uh, we'll see. Do I get my redemption? Do I make my comeback? You guys will have to wait and see. Um, and then, uh, and then we'll have the live next week. So four ways to enter. And actually, actually there's multiple ways to enter because starting this week, I Starting, I think, tomorrow's video, I ask additional questions. I ask questions to you, community, to answer in the, the comments below. So you can actually get two entries per video. See what I did there? More, more chances for you guys to win, right? <laughs> so, anyhow, I'm done. I'm done ranting or talking ranting. Rant, what the hell am I talking about here? I'm tired. It's midnight. I need to go to bed. Five o'clock is going to suck in the morning. <laughs> but let's spin it. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna shuffle it up three times. I didn't shuffle. Sorry. I need to shuffle. So we're gonna shuffle it three times. One. Oh no. Okay. Two. Three. Holy f word. So here we go. We got it here. I gotta figure out a way to make it bigger. 
Don't know why it's not bigger. So let's spin it to see who wins the 250 sub giveaway. And Funko Mama. Funko Mama. So let me uh, write this down. I don't think she's here. I'll have to reach out to her. Um, because I don't think I've ever seen her comment on my videos until she commented on this one. So I will I'll have to check. I'll make sure she's actually subbed to me too. Because if she's not subbed to me, that's kind of a deal breaker. Because again, I mean, we hit 250 subs. Uh, but I'll reach out to the to the person uh, to to Funko Mama and uh, and see. So that's who won. Thank you guys again. Present went no. I said no. I I. I I'm not, I don't make that rule because I know it's late. Uh, it's almost, you know, it's midnight here. So I know it is later. Uh, so I'm not going to, I don't make that the requirement. So I'll uh, reach out to her in the comment where she commented. I'll reply if, if, and here's the thing. If I don't hear from Funko Mama, I'll give, I mean, I'll give them, if I don't hear anything by next week, guess what? If we don't hear anything by next week, this will be up next week again. So I'll, I'll do it that way. If I don't hear uh, hear from Funko Mama uh, by that time. You know, I'll reach out to her on the the comment that she made. I'll see if she's off, she's on Instagram. I'm not sure. Um, <laughs> right, Mike, man. And again, I appreciate that, dude. The fact that, buddy, you're 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 out in the wilderness and everything. Um, you know, I appreciate being here, Mike. You have been you've been an awesome awesome member awesome buddy and uh awesome friend so nice nice comic burrito yeah that would get you to 200 man if you guys aren't go ahead and check out comic burrito that's another thing i'm i'm all for the subbing each other up uh checking each other out you know helping everybody hit milestones um i know that right now um jb did today on his live stream he uh, he is was given the push for Mama J to get to a thousand. That'd be awesome because Mama J and Spectre love their videos, love the channel, love the fact that she puts in drop a link. Yeah, um, any of my uh, any of my mods, um, Amanda, if you could drop a link for Comic Burrito, um, so that anyone that wants to go uh, go sub them up and let me get off of this screen. Why am I? I'm, I'm having you guys. What am I new here? I am new here, right? New to doing this stuff. So yeah, Geeky Mama, or was well, not Geeky Mama Bear. Uh, Amanda, if you could drop a link, that'd be great. So I would love to see Mama J get to that. And I know like uh, another one is um, the, the what was the Hero and, Hero and the Kid? That I love, I mean, that, the kid, they're doing interviews of, of, of artists and everything. It's awesome, dude. So uh, it is after midnight. Uh, thank you guys for hanging out. Like I said, if I do not get in, if I can't get in contact with um, with Funko Mama, again, I haven't seen her comment on, on any of my other videos. Uh, again, I don't have a ton of comments on my videos. So I, I, I recognize every one of you who come in, who come by and drop a, drop a comment. Um, I'll, I'll see. I'm going to give them a week. I'll give them a week. And then if I don't hear anything by Tuesday night, uh, watch my Instagram because you'll see it be like, hey, wasn't claimed. So it goes back up for next week. So and and maybe by next week, <clears throat> maybe by next week, there might be something else added to there. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> we'll see. So um, I appreciate it. What to do is, man. Yeah, I'll, I'll look out for you for you contacting me, man. Um, again, thank you for that too, by the way. Uh, again, I, I want to say I, in closing here, I, I love this community. I love the people, uh, that, you know, that I've gravitated towards. I love the content. Um, I love watching videos. I love watching the different stuff that people are getting. I love the, the, what is it? The camaraderie, man, words are hard for me. I'm <laughs> so the, the, um, the bond, the bond that is here. Uh, and, and the fact that it's kind of like a blessing in disguise, you know, with COVID it sucked. It's really hurt a lot of people, um, both 
health wise and financially because of losing, you know, losing jobs and being furloughed and everything. Uh, but what has the, the, the silver lining, if there could be ever sil- silver lining in this is the, the friendships that have been able to be made. So, um, I, I, I truly, uh, um, I truly do appreciate every single one of you guys that watch my videos. I, I try to keep that as genuine as possible. Um, for me, it's something that, um, I mean, it's, it's a weird feeling, you know, and I don't think I'll ever lose that, that feeling of it being weird that strange strangers, random people, which again, you guys are becoming friends. You know, you, a lot of you guys are becoming friends and it's just weird that people watch me open boxes. Um, I, I don't mean to come off callous about that or not, or, or, or not. I don't even think callous is the right word. But the fact that you guys take the time out of your day to watch me open video, open boxes and doing these videos, uh, it, it blows my mind. It really does. Um, so as we grow, as we are the little engine that could, and again, we go, we, we make this road down the train tracks and we slowly grow this channel. Um, there's going to be a couple things. So, uh, I like that. I like that. I like that. Uh, barbarian. I like that. Um, there's going to be a couple things. So look out. Um, if you guys follow me on IG, watch out there. Cause I might drop a couple announcements on there. I might drop a, I'm going to be dropping a video announcement video here in the next week or so, um, about something I want to do. But again, um, I mean, it's just really, I want to do these giveaways weekly to give back to you guys. That's why I like to do it. And we hit these marks. Like I said, we can get to 500. I don't know when it's, if it's going to be in a two months, three months, whenever it's going to happen. But when it happens, um, I've got some pretty special stuff to give out. I, I really do. I, I enjoy between the <laughs> between the uh, you know the, between both comic and pop. It's been awesome, and that's like when when we do the get the the swaps. I'm all for it. Sign me up every time. I told Mama J that I will, I will be in it every time. Um, and I mean that because it's, it's amazing to be able to, again, to exchange stuff like this and then to watch all 40 of the videos and man, it was, it was just awesome. It was really awesome. So, um, so yeah, uh, I'm going to call it a night guys. I'm finally going to get out of here. I'm done talking. I, I'll talk all night. I, again, I, I could do this for hours. We're at an hour and 45 minutes and that was with me freezing and dropping coming back. So, um, ah, thank you guys. Thank you guys again. I can't stop. Can't stop being thankful. Um, so have a good night, everybody. I hope everyone stays healthy. Um, stay safe. It's tough. I know here in Florida, did I just freeze? Oh, my God. Please tell me I didn't freeze again. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, I'm going to bed. I am exhausted. I got to sort this stuff. Watch out for my video tomorrow. It's a good comic book video. Uh, Till next time, guys. I'll see you. Have a great night. And we're out.